Hello everybody, this is Pierre Gerudi and tonight I'm going to answer another question which I received through the social media and the question is what type of accessories sold the most in Asia during lockdown? People will do anything to pass their time during isolation from meditation to Netflix binging or just playing video games and so on. To stave off the feelings of boredom, those who can afford, they go online shopping, put their hands on designer handbags like of Gucci, Saint Laurent, Chanel, Louis Vuitton and the likes. net a reported as of the month leading up to May 4th, sale of handbags saw a strong growth of 261% in the Asia Pacific compared to last year. People may not go for designer clothes or shoes unless they try them on first so the fit can be guaranteed but handbags doesn't need defeating and it goes right to your arms all you need is a 2d photos of the bag on a fashion model it's all considered as a feeling good retail therapy it brings down your stress level while social distancing is still in place. Some people also doing it as an investment since some of the bags will fetch you better returns than your property. Before the pandemic struck, consumers would usually purchase luxury goods abroad where it is cheaper than their own home country. With travel restriction and stay at home notices, however, purchases are now happening more frequently within their home country, with online shopping fast becoming the new normal. The surge in a back sales is a vast contrast to otherwise gloomy retail outlook that is blighting the world. In Singapore, for example, retail sales for the apparel and footwear category plunged by about 85.3% in April compared to last year before. On the list, which has 250,000 members around the region, including 22,000 members in Singapore, saw a 15% growth in consumer traffic in April and May. During this time, it sold 134,000 units of products, including cosmetic, wine, and handbags, compared to just 6,000 units over the same time period last year. According to Netaporte, shoppers in Singapore favored small to medium sized bags in classic style with Bottega Veneta among the favorites. Other popular designs include Gucci, Gigi Marmont and Dionysi's Rangers and Saint Laurent's monogram Lulu and Lou styles. Now, quote of the day. You can buy happiness, but you can buy bags. And that's kind of same thing. I hope I could answer the question as briefly as I could and I hope I could add some value. If you like it, please hit the like button, subscribe it, share it and leave comments. On the comments, your questions, your remarks, your suggestions or your critics. I will try to answer all of them. So 
Good night. See you tomorrow night with another question and another answer. Bye.